welcome to your weekly forecast for February 9th until 16th. Now let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Okay, Leo. Looks like an air sign. Uh, we'll be uh, tearing you apart this week. And, uh, you know, if you're trying to make a decision about your relationship with this person, it's like, uh, you know, whether you, if you should stay or go, I mean, you're already, you know, um, one foot in the other and one foot in, in the inside. And um, I feel like you're having a lot of you know, questions, issues, and uh, it seems like you're starting to question this relationship with this person because at first it was okay, you know, you've had a lot of um, a lot of things in common and uh, you were always at the mutual, um, you know, stage in your relationship. But then right now, it seems like this person wants to lead a relationship and even wants to possess you. And that is a big no-no for you. It also feels like this person is, uh, you know, kind of a one-way person, you know, or, or wants to have a one-way relationship. Like, it's all about what he wants and, uh, you know, whatever you want, it will come later on or last and the least. Um, communications will also be a little bit, uh, you know, on and off this week. And, uh, if there are something for you, if there are something that you've been waiting for or something to hear from someone, especially from a water sign or cancer, um, or, you know, if it's, a, if it's news, um, regarding a, um, you know, like, a regarding boat or wa regarding water or something like that. Um, it seems like you need to wait for a little bit, either another day or another week. But don't expect that things will be, you know, like coming in right away because I feel like there will be a lot of delays and there will be a lot of issues that's going to be coming your way this week. And, uh, you know, those things that you've been waiting for, it seems like you need to, you know, n divert your attention someplace else. And uh, it seems like while you're trying to move away or break away or have a break from this air sign, you will be traveling within the weekends or within right in the middle of the week. Okay, because you just want to break away from this person. You want, you want to have a little breather or you want to think because uh, this person is overcrowding you. And uh, he won't even let you be who you are. He won't even be. You, he won't even let you be by yourself. And um, right now you're feeling a little bit alone, and uh, you know, feeling isolated, waiting for something to happen, to pan out, to shape up. And uh, you will see a friend, or you will try to mingle with your friends, especially. Seeing someone who's a, who's an earth sign, okay, and uh, there will be some changes in your home environment as well. It seems like you're going to be um, inviting this person into your house, or you're going to be crashing into their house for the meanwhile that you're taking a break from your relationship. And right after that, it seems like you are going to be forming a decision about this relationship of yours. Now, when it comes to your to your workplace, especially if you're working in the military, law, legal, government, bank, you know, and uh, more likely um, like stocks, you know, stock market, um, things will not be in favor of you this week. Okay, and there is actually a very disappointing news or disappointing correspondence that you will be receiving the first day of the week. Alright. 
you will also try to negotiate some terms or some stipulations with a water sign around your work and it seems like this person is not going to be hearing you or they're just going to bypass you or just ignore you okay so it's going to be a little bit frustrating week for you but don't you worry because you know um this is only for this week and the good thing here is you will be traveling and you're going to be able to see some of your friends or some of your relatives because this is the only time where you can find an excuse to spend time with them okay and uh i feel like you need to ah okay you know there's also another thing because the reason why this air sign is being too possessive or being too concerned about the securities of your relationship is because they are the one is doing something right behind you you already have a feeling about this and you're already starting to you know it's like you already have a hunch and you're already starting to have some suspicions that this person is doing something you know like uh and extra activities aside from their work and uh, they're being overly paranoid lately as well so at first you're starting to it's like you know you, you were thinking like what's going on with this person and you thought that they're only concerned that they or that they really love you so much that they don't want to lose you for any other thing but lately it's becoming more and more overbearing and uh it uh you know it's all but suffocating you so you know you, it's like you're already having a hard time getting a grip of the situation because you've been working and you're only focused on your career growth but this person just keeps on um you know like um what do you call this like uh you know getting your attention or they are just throwing some unnecessary dramas in your life and you just don't simply want it okay and it seems like this person is the one who's doing something it's time for you to investigate all right let's take a look at your Marco cards. Imagine to the sea, the tribe, chop wood, which is this is the one that you're going to be making a decision about serendipity okay you were under the impression that this relationship from the beginning was like a soulmate thing or a soulmate connection or you know it's like the two of you are really meant to be together but then things are starting to become even more different and overbearing and too taxing and uh, it's consuming too much of your energy that it's already like uh, taking a toll on you now you need to use your instincts and you need to create more solution if you really want to keep this relationship for now okay but you need to take some time off for yourself you need to go out there you know try as i've said that you're going to be traveling if you want to spend time with uh, some people that's close to you that's you know that's better it's good but it is much better for you to go and find yourself okay and you will also be paying a visit to your family or to your relatives by the weekends now chop wood this is actually the thing that you're going to be making a decision about you want to cut off something that you feel like it's just consuming you and you just couldn't really handle this kind of person or situation or a relationship okay because if it's just going to consume a lot of your energy and a lot of your patience then it's not really worth it and you can't even call it as true love okay and you thought that this relationship was like you know this person is like your soulmate because they are you know they are you know they are they're a perfect match and you finished each other's sentences or you know something like that but <laughs> things are starting to become even more obvious and there are already some red flag signs that's been showing up and you just need to you know recognize them 
So. Um, whatever that's faded will happen and will take place. And um, it is much better for you to take some time off. And if the two of you are really meant to be together, then, you know, um, it will stick together. All right. So anyway, that's it for you for this week, Leo. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live with the calls, which is it's already available on my website, sophieangel.net. Um, it's there, and uh, you just need to click on it and register in my website to access it. And uh, you know, pre-recorded video readings are also available. <coughs> and uh, get your annual personal forecast for 2019. All right. Anyway, have a great weekend and blessings to you.